start out this video I just do want to say I am a little sick so I do apologize if my voice sounds a little weird but today I will be reviewing this Lego Star Wars The Last Jedi poly bag this is Kylo Ren's shuttle it is set number 30380 comes with 33 pieces and is recommended for ages 6 to 12 and this is actually the second um, mini Kylo Ren's command shuttle that Lego has made and uh, here you can see the set details again and you got the uh, Last Jedi uh, toy logo. And also, that's what the set is going to look like when built. And you got that uh, Disney logo. And then on the back, you got all that weird stuff that nobody reads. And this set is currently, uh, at the time of making this video, it is available at Target stores uh, for $4. And I'm going to go ahead and get this thing cut open and move me out of the way. So I will be doing a uh, speed build of this thing, but first I guess I have to get it open, so let's go ahead and do that. Cut right here, hopefully I cut, yep, okay, stuff's already spilling out. Let's move that. Let's see what we got in here. Okay, so that's that. Poly bag is now empty. And it looks like we got some uh, black and gray in here. And for the instructions, actually just have the standard win uh, thing. So, let's see how this is the back. So the logo is horizontal. Sorry, I bumped the camera there. So the logo is horizontal, but the instructions are vertical. So just through the pieces a little bit here. Anything interesting? Uh, doesn't look like it. Um, I mean, there are uh, these two pieces right here. But other than that, I mean, this piece is pretty cool. Uh, it's a pretty cool piece right there. But uh, otherwise, pieces are not too interesting. So I'm going to go ahead and get this thing all built up. So guys, here is the completed command shuttle, and I have to say, this is already so much more accurate compared to the previous version, which I actually have right next to me here, so I'll bring that in. So, yeah, you can see there is a world of difference between these two guys. So you can just get all of it in the shot. And then, like, um, you can see here, these wings can go out like a plane. I mean, that's that's not exactly accurate. But, so you can go out in its flying mode. That and the landing gear are a little weird. But this one, can't do that. So they've definitely improved uh, with the newer model. And you can see, like, the whole um, like cockpit area and fuselage and all that. It's a lot smaller, and I do like the way that they did the landing gear. I think that's a pretty cool uh, technique. And I also like how they use like the little like uh, handlebar thingies uh, as uh, guns. And uh, like I pointed out, you can have it go all the way down like this. So, and if you hold it this way, you know, you can get a pretty cool looking thing out of that. But then it still folds up in its landing position. And you can see the wings are pretty much just two pieces, uh, which is kind of ridiculous. And um, I do like just the little bit of detail that they have on here. And I also really like the use of these uh, slope pieces right here. I think they just add a nice bit of detail. Not really sure what this is supposed to represent, um, but it's there. 
And, um, yes, yeah, so it's kind of funny. Because this is actually the most accurate Kylo Ren's command shuttle. Sorry, I keep bumping the camera today. Um, this is actually the most accurate Kylo Ren's command shuttle that LEGO has released. Um, obviously there was this one that I just showed you. There's also the uh, mini figure, more like the play scale version, uh, that pretty much had the same design uh, with the gray and straight wings. So, um, yeah, like I said, this is the most accurate Kylo Ren's command shuttle so far. And it would be nice if LEGO remade on um, the more, um, like, play scale, um, version of Kylo Ren's shuttle. Uh, just to make it more accurate, since the original is not accurate at all to the movie. So, uh, yeah. I feel like this is a pretty cool poly bag, and for four bucks, you really can't say no. Especially if you're a Star Wars fan, fan of the sequel trilogy, and or you just like Kylo Ren. So, I mean, if you see this at your local Target store, I would highly recommend getting this. I think it's a pretty good deal for four bucks. And, yeah. So overall, I really like this set, and you guys can know what you think of this little poly bag, either by voting in the card in the top right hand corner of the video, or by leaving a comment down below. And if you did enjoy today's video, please just click that subscribe button, and also like, comment, and share the video. Thanks for watching guys.